my fellow Americans, the heartbreaking devastation and suffering caused by Hurricane Harvey has profoundly affected our entire nation. Many homes and communities have been destroyed. Many lives have been upended. And tragically, some have lost their lives in this catastrophic storm. We pray for the victims and their families and all of those who have been displaced from their homes. At this very moment, heroic efforts continue to keep safe those threatened by this natural disaster. I want to say a special word of thanks to our amazing first responders, our police and law enforcement officers, firefighters, Coast Guard, National Guard, EMS, doctors, nurses, hospital workers, and volunteers who have traveled from all across the country. Thousands of people have come together to prevent loss of life and ensure safety. And we are incredibly grateful for their courage, their professionalism, and their sacrifice. They are an inspiration to all of us. To the people affected by Hurricane Harvey, we are with you every single step of the way. We will help you recover. We will help you rebuild. We will support you today, tomorrow, and the day after. We have been working closely with local authorities, and I remain in close communication with Governor Abbott of Texas and Governor Edwards of Louisiana. At the request of Governor Abbott, I declared a major disaster in the state of Texas to ensure that federal aid is available for state and local recovery efforts. I also approved a disaster declaration for Louisiana. Organizations like the Red Cross, the Salvation Army, and faith-based organizations are actively assisting on the ground, and they are doing a fantastic job. I want to recognize the millions of citizens across the country who are contributing in every way they can with their time, their resources, and their prayers. When one part of America hurts, we all hurt. When we see neighbors in need, we rush to their aid. We don't ask their names or where they're from. We help our fellow Americans every single time. This is the spirit of America. It's exactly what I saw while in Texas this week, a spirit of love, determination, and resolve. A spirit that, even when wounded, never gives up, never gives in, never loses hope. We just keep fighting. We just keep pushing on for the people we love and for the nation we call home. All American hearts are with the people of Texas and Louisiana. We mourn and pray and struggle through the hardships together. We know that a long and difficult path lies ahead to get our neighbors back in their homes and on their feet. But we also know that we are stronger than the obstacles in our path. Arm in arm, we will strive, we will endure, and we will emerge stronger than ever before. Thank you, God bless you, and God bless the United States of America.